Well, hello there, Gemini, and welcome to your forecast from the Gasmic Tarot. This is a general reading, love, money, career, for the period beginning the 4th of January. Happy New Year. Hey, since it is a general reading, it may not uh, resonate with all of you. If it does, throw a comment below. If you want to claim the reading, throw a comment below. But also, you might want to look at the forecast for your moon sign or for your rising sign as well. Okay, get a full picture. Hey, let's get started. Hey, thanks again for liking and subscribing so YouTube can find my new channel. Really appreciate that. Really do appreciate that. All right, if this is your first time, know that I do channel messages from Spirit. Yep, thanks, Spirit. And I have a ton of spirits in my space. I also get to see some of, get to experience some of your spirits. Apparently, for some of you who are guided to these videos, I'm getting a doorway full of spirits, pushy spirits. They laugh, they cry, they curse, they show me things I cannot unsee. They sing. Somebody for a Leo reading a couple of weeks ago turned my television on. So you can imagine what it's like in my place during, during these readings. It is so full of energy. Sometimes the dog, they like to annoy the dog sometimes. And thankfully so far this morning, they're leaving her alone. All right, so for, for Gemini, for the period beginning the 4th of January, guys, what do we got? All right, Queen of Rods in reverse. That is the Five of Cups in reverse. Nine of Rods in reverse. Six of Rods in reverse. We have the Death card. Oh, and we have the Ace of Pentacles. Let's, let's start with that and see if we need to do anything else. Okay? We'll do it that way. Um, all right, so... Wow, Queen of Rods in reverse. All right, so we, you're starting off this period, Gemini, with a, with a lot of dis, disorder, okay? And I'm using the word disorder because uh, there really needs to be an, some kind of organization here in your space. Uh, things are... Really, just out of control uh, in your in your in your mind space. Um, that's exacerbated by it being out of out of organization in your physical space. So, spirit is saying, start to organize your thought. But this 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 order is or disorder is just going to continue to rule. Um, And, you know, it's coupled with this, with this Five of Cups. There's something going on here uh, in your space, for those of you who, who this resonates with, because there are some, uh, some of you who are pure Gemini. Uh, you're not on the cusp. You, you have a very, very strong Gemini presence. And... This, this Five of Cups in reverse, you know, it's, it's really about oh, kind of being at the low point, okay? There's no place up from here but up. There's nowhere, there's nowhere up, no, you know, the only direction is up. There's some big disappointment this week uh, or, or right before this period that's a that's kind of still coming through this period there's something that you're expecting uh to happen some big revelation some big surprise and you know sometimes you know you just got to call a spade a spade there's something that you're just not allowing uh yourself to let go of and it's time to just say um i've got to let go uh, of, of this so you know, and, and so you've got this nine of, of rods and the nine of rods, you know, and that's in reverse. And it's about strong opposition. There's something that you want. 
Okay. And there's strong opposition for you getting it. Maybe it's that's manifest in the physical plane. Maybe it's manifest in the spiritual plane or both. So if you think that you're going to take that victory lap this, this period, uh, no, I, I, I don't see it happening. I do not see it happening. I don't see the victory lap happening this week at all. Uh, the six of, of, of uh, rods, when it's in reverse, it's about what you've hoped for. It's not going to materialize. And, and maybe you've had a, um, a life where everything you asked for, you received. This is going to be a very, if that's the case, this might be a very hard um, experience to swallow. But we all come here with experiences uh, in order to grow. So just know that this is an opportunity for positive growth for you that's going to ring in a, um, an ending, okay? But this ending isn't a bad thing for you, okay? It's an ending um, for, to a transformation and rebuilding. So based on this, you might need to find a new place to live. You know, uh, there might, you know, there's a place that you're living in no longer serves you. It no longer meets your needs or the circumstances um, where you might might be looking to move. Maybe for maybe it's for this new beginning that's happening here. Uh, relationships will end. Uh, there'll be a separation of what you of people in you that maybe you considered as friends because of a lot of the stuff that that's being held on to here. Um, career change, the ending of an existing career. All right. So all that's coming in during this, this period and the realization of it's time to let it go. It's time to let it go, whatever it is you're holding on to. And I know a lot of, um, uh, people in the Gemini specifically might say, well, I'm not holding on to anything. Well, you certainly, you know, I had a couple of that because this is coming up the last few readings about holding on to something. And some, and some people were very angry about that. Yeah, well, you're holding on to anger now, aren't you? Okay. Uh, one was, as they gave me a comment, they were holding on to a past ex and all the hurt there. We're all holding on to something. But there's something that you just can't get out of your craw. And you, and, and, the universe is going to drag you there kicking and screaming. Do yourself a favor. Realize that you might need to let go in order to move forward. And I see most of it being a career and so, so, so I see about a 50-50 split here. Half of you are dealing with something from a current career slash job. And the other half are dealing with a uh, relationship, uh, a past, you know, you're holding on to the idea of being with a particular person or you're holding on to the pain uh, that's not helping you move forward. Uh, you can't hold on to the anger forever, you know, the, 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 the disappointment. Now, if you allow yourself to let go, you have a whole new beginning. Okay, and the and and the beginning. Look at here. You've got the 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 uh, the red rose. That's about food chakra, root chakra, food, water, shelter. How I see myself in the world. It's about money. Okay, you have the white flower. That's about spiritualism. So something you can. So you're moving into a new career, into a new beginning, into the new home, new. Things that will stir your passion, open your heart, elevate your vibration here, okay? You have that opportunity, all right, if you allow it in. But the only way you're going to allow it in, you know, okay, so somebody's singing me that song, let it go, let it go, okay? Let it go. Let go of the old crap in order to open yourself up to the new beginning, Stop hold, Stop beating a dead horse, somebody's showing me. Stop beating a dead horse. I said, showing me a horse over a clothesline with one of those, those rug beaters from the 20s, I think. Anyway, uh, 
the new beginning is right here. Open your eyes. Someone's going, open your eyes. Open your eyes. Okay. So let's see what we have for the Ascended Master card. Who do we have? Oh, look, we got Kuan Yin again. Okay. It's <laughs> let it go. You guys are funny upstairs. Okay. Let go of the struggle. Let go of the anger. Let go of the unforgiveness. Let go of the situation. Um, uh, trust the universe is on your side and will open up a new door to you. Okay. That's what Kuan Yin is telling you. This is what you need to do. Here's your homework, Gemini. And if you do, change will open up the door to a new beginning filled with things more wondrous than you can imagine. All right. Hey, thanks again for liking and subscribing. Throw a comment below if you want to claim the video or if it resonates with you or if you want to move forward, you want me to resonate with your energy and take care.